nice quiet day in the gym. Weekend review. Uh, what's the date? I don't know. 3rd of August. Clips of the week, and we're starting off strong with Ludo's hitting his first unassisted dips. Not only did he do that, he added five kilos to it. So well done Ludo, that's a pretty big milestone. Uh, we did dips later in the week on the rings, so that'll be the next goal. Let's also give another shout out to Hannah, who got the rower 500 split below one minute 40, which is pretty, pretty fast. Uh, absolutely big pulls on that position, so good job to Hat. Continuing on on Monday, let's give a shout out to Holly for smashing out deadlifts at 100 kilos. Always a good milestone to rip those triple figures. And then let's also give a shout out to the big bird, Birdie, for hitting up Adam Brown Hero Workout at 7 and obviously crushing it because the dude is bonkers strong. So move ahead to Tuesday and just one for today, I wanna to give a big shout out to Alana for going 50 kilos on the front squats. That was up from 45 kilos on last time she did it. So fantastic work, Alana, getting stronger in those positions. We'll be able to clean that weight in no time. Wednesday, let's give a shout out to the big Ev dog for setting the standard on the pump workout. Uh, I threw down a few sets of um, how far you should get in the workout and the boys were like, I can do that. Meanwhile, they were humbled. So good job, Ev, big effort. Then I'm gonna hit up Max Edie for such great positions in Ollie class. I appreciate the coaching uh, recep uh, reception, I guess. Um, Max is always moving well and is killing it. Let's give another shout out to Courtney, Edie, and Jess, who wears black for still training while pregnant. Cool, that stuff is hard. And actually Jess came in today on Saturday and said that she might have her baby next week. So that's super exciting. Looking forward to that Jess and good luck with the birth, if I don't see her. Then I wanna give another shout out on Wednesday to the old school Brendo for making epic playlists for the gym and two, just being an absolute ninja. Coming in, crushes it, walks back out, smile on his face uh, every time you say hi to him. So such a nice guy and always killing it as usual. Friday, let's give a shout out to, or a welcome, sorry, to Tanya who trained for three days with us, uh, visiting from the other side of Melbourne. So awesome to have you in Tanya. Um, it was nice shooting the shit with you and Hopefully I'll see you again soon. Um, another silent ninja award, Danny Hunter. Such a weapon, uh, absolute sort of dark horse style training. She just demolishes workouts that you throw at her and smiles about it after the fact and is very modest as well. And we're doubling up on lots, on lots of things here. That's cool. All right, I'm gonna give another shout out to Brett. Big week, Brett, for I appreciate you taking on my advice and doing interval style training versus destroying yourself in long workouts that are just gonna make you stressed out and tired. So thank you, Brett, for listening. <laughs> then on Friday, let's give another shout out to Jack, the work experience kid who's hanging out with us for a little while. I think he's going in a couple of weeks uh, for doing co-hero workout with me on Friday during the day. So that was fun. And then we'll give Max another shout out for hitting up the deadlifts on Friday as well. Uh, Max has been dealing with a back injury for basically ever, um, but has pretty much, that's been done. Done, back injury, tick, we no longer injured. Fantastic, love it. Deadlifts proved it the other day. Moving ahead to Saturday, I wanna thank the gymnastics class and Tommy for programming the Toes to Bar series that we're looking at. Um, a lot of strength gains to be had with Toes to Bar. A lot of the time, strength is just the biggest element. You know, you can skill as much as we like, but we need the strength at some point. So good work to our Ollie team. Uh, congratulations, I hope your Toes to Bar have gotten heaps better. I know they would have if you stayed consistent. Then on Saturday, I want to give a shout out to Mel Russell, who hit up the front squats in the workout. Sneeze. Uh, and she's been dealing with her wrist problem for quite a while, so good job to Mel. Mel is one of the most pragmatic, and a down to earth athletes you will ever meet. Lovely person and has been in the gym for quite a while. Thank you, Mel, for your efforts and we'll see you soon. Let's talk about events. All right, we'll get the easy ones out to begin with. 
Tommy wants to go bouldering with you guys this month. He wants to go and show off his bouldering skills while doing that. So let's make a date. I'll ask Tommy specifically. We'll get a bouldering day coming up. It's good fun if you haven't tried it before. Just a good blowout. Fun to test some pulling power and how you're going in that position. So we'll make a day. I'll confirm with Tommy first what's up. Secondly, four weeks away. So four weeks away from now, we have our bonfire birthday party bonanza in Wensleydale. So we're having a bonfire. We're having a birthday celebration because the gym turned 11. You come down, you can bring some beers and some burgers and all the fun things we would want. We have our own place because uh, one of the members of the gym has a farm out in Wensleydale, which is only 20 minutes from Warren Ponds. So you can camp the night if you want. You can bring your dog, family. You can bring your motorbike, I think. I'll double check that. But yeah, all the fun things to have a little party out in the bush. Should be good fun. If you're keen, you need to RSVP. I'll put a link in the email. Additionally, after that, on the 6th of September, there is an oceanic weightlifting competition going on. It's kind of similar to the open though, where you can do it within the gym. Uh, so you do a max snatch, max clean and jerk. On the 6th, I'll make that night, that Ollie class, a, like an event and we'll have it in. I'm pretty sure I need to adjudicate um, the lifts to make sure they're correct. Uh, but since we have the fun camera, we'll film the whole thing and make a bit of an event out of it. So Max Snatch, Max Clean and Jerk, 6th of September on the Friday night. Also in September, Tommy will be away unfortunately, so he's gonna kill our totals, but that's okay. Uh, from the 5th to the 25th, I believe, of September. Um, so you'll see a lot of me, whether you like that or not. We'll see how we go. I know my wife won't, but that is what it is. <laughs> Mandy's Run Club, still going strong. Eastern Beach, if you are interested in running, 1 p.m. Eastern Beach. Uh, she's down there to teach you how to run a bit better. Definitely worth a go if you are keen on doing that. Uh, one of our old school members is back in Geelong uh, for a few months, intermittently, Sarah Drew. You might have seen her today in today's Saturday class. She was telling me that she actually has a side hustle, which I'm gonna promote. So she sells artwork, so if you're keen to get some artwork in, you can see I'll put the thing up right here, but you can she makes some pretty fantastic art. Some of this stuff is crazy good. Some nice boobs there, always keen for boobs. But um, yeah, definitely check it out. Uh, she sells her art, it's some awesome stuff, all original, all that kind of stuff. So if you're keen in that market, then you wanna hit it up, then definitely uh, worth a go. I thought, you know, spruik anyone's stuff who is checking it out. Also, speaking of spruiking members stuff, while we're here, you wanna get on board Michaela's YouTube channel. She's uh, starting up and running. Let's have a quick squeeze. Here it is, okay. So Michaela's YouTube channel, again, I'll screen record in the side here. She's got two videos so far. Uh, if you don't know Michaela, she's a, a cycling enthusiast slash awesome. Uh, you can see the first, look at the difference between the first video and the second video, amazing. Get on there, subscribe to her YouTube channel. Even if you don't have YouTube, just subscribe. Uh, it'll really help her out. Um, she's currently got six subscribers and two videos. So we all start somewhere, which is so cool. I'm so super keen for that. Let's have a look at Lost Property because I always forget that because I not do my weekend review here. So I'll go grab it. Ooh, cool, so we still have this shirt here. It's been a while, let's call it one more week. If this is still here, we will donate that to charity. I uh, have an XL hoodie. This could be mine actually. It's not mine, it doesn't smell like me. <laughs> XL hoodie, CrossFit Barman one. And then also an Oakley hoodie, there we go, cool. Pretty nice, it is a regular fit. Oh, it doesn't have a size. Yes it does, XL, extra awesome. Two XL in Japan. That might be pretty much it, hey? Um, so we've got, we got the Christmas party, or Christmas party, gosh, birthday party, weightlifting, bouldering, Tommy wants to hit up. Um, it could just be like a casual get together for bouldering, doesn't have to be too crazy. Um, definitely keen for that. And then Olympic total. Oh, uh, the other day on Discord, if you're not on Discord, make sure you get on there. Uh, I put up some designs. Um, I, literally, I was just mucking around on Canva in the middle of the night, trying to make some designs. I'll pop them up on this side and yeah, let me know what you think. 
Uh, if you like them, I can put them on a t-shirt. I know, I, I do like the I Am Relentless one. Um, the other one with the CrossFit data, I kind of just copied off someone else. But that's kind of the point, isn't it? <laughs> There's no original thought anymore. I didn't get AI to make them, so I made them. Uh, but I'll try and put them on the shop soon. If you want to, if you're a bit fancy with art and or graphics and you reckon you could whip up something that would look cool, feel free to hit me up and I'll send you all the um, original images and you can whip up a cool CrossFit bar one logo if you want and have it customized and go from there. I reckon a fun Australian one would be fun. See how we go. Anyway, we can review 3rd of August.